Hi, welcome to the complete workout. This program has been designed to give you a total workout that you can adapt to your own level of fitness. All right, are you ready? Yeah. Ready? Let's go. Stand with your feet a little more than hip distance apart. Hips are under, stomach in, chest is lifted, shoulders back and down, knees are bent over the toes. Ready? Inhale up and down. Lightly and breathe and back. Ready for curls? Biceps. One, two, three. Warm up those arms. Up and back. Don't let your elbows bend. Press your shoulder blades together. Knees are bent over your toes. Hips are tucked under. Don't stick out. And down. Straight to the side and down. Don't let your arms pull forward. And be sure that the wrist is neutral. Not like this. Keep it nice and flat. This develops. Inhale. Two more. Up and down. Last time. Up and down. Roll down. Get your heavier weights if you want to. And roll back up again. Last set of shoulder shrugs. Up and back. Way up and press your shoulder blades Nice together. flat back. Neck is in alignment with your back. Don't look up. Don't let your head hang down. Up and down. No joints. These front raises work the front part of the deltoid muscle, the anterior deltoid, and it helps prevent shoulder. Right. We're going to go on to push-ups. Push-ups are great to develop the chest muscle, the pectoralis, the front of the shoulders, and the triceps in the back of the arm. Correct posture while you're doing push-ups is critical, so listen carefully to my directions. Some of us are going to do them on our knees. This is an easier way. If you're stronger, do them from your toes. Hands should be slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Cross your ankles if you're doing them from your knees. Inhale down, exhale up. Down. Change arms. And breathe. Work those thighs. Woo. Six, seven. Oh, now we're going to do three more and walk left. Two, oh, look out. three, walk left. Oh. One, two, three, walk right. One, yeah. two, Woo. three, walk left. Last time, we're going to walk right and walk. Now keep going with your heels out. Now change to touch and reach. Touch, reach, touch, reach. That's right. Now heel touches again. Down, up, down, up. Work those thighs and touch, reach, reach. That's right. Thumb a ride back. Two more times. Last, bend your knees, tuck your hips under. We're going to do a set of exercises for the hip muscles. Ready? Under, hold, hold, release. Under, release. Feel these muscles contracting. Stomach is in. Don't arch. Just come to a neutral position. Hold, make it work. Come on, really squeeze it. No free rides now. And squeeze, two, three, release. As you get stronger, you may want to put on ankle weights. Start with one pound and increase to no more than five pounds on each ankle. Then sit up and roll over to the other side. All right. Stretch out, head on your arm, bend that bottom knee, extend the top leg. Ready, lift it up and down, up and down. Three, inhale, here. 
your elbows back and down. Curl up, hold, hold, and down. Curl it up, hold, hold, all the way back. Up, hold, hold, and down. Go to the right and down. Exhale and down. We're working the obliques now. This is great for your lower belly. And lift and lift. Now, if you're tired, you should stop. If you want more ab work, uncross your ankles, put your hands on your thighs, tuck up, lift it up, up. You don't go back this time. This is not full range of motion. Woo! These are small crunches. Stand the opposite leg and bring the other knee over to the side. Curl your pelvis up. Extend your arm out to the side, shoulder height. Turn and look at that arm. Lengthen your back. The floor, feet up. come parallel. Bend your knees and roll up with bent knees. And reach the right arm up. Stretch the other palm down. Feel the stretch up the right side of the body. Very good, you did it. It was a good class. All right.